Okay then guys, welcome to the finals video for round 6 of the Castlecombe Karting Championship and we've qualified second in the C final, we're not not too happy about that, we didn't have, we had a good start to the heats, heat 3 was alright, could have been better, but then heat 4 we ended up just finishing last, we couldn't get through. So we're in, in second on this one and um, yeah spoke to uh, Ali, obviously we raced Ali twice already today, ended up pretty close to him all day, so just spoke to him, and uh, yeah, the usual plan of, we're in the qualifying positions, let's not sabotage ourselves, there's no point in us two fighting each other for eight laps, and keeping the other guys behind super close, we'll just see who gets away better, follow each other for a few laps, pull away from the guys behind, and then uh, last lap, two laps, then we can have a bit of a fight to decide the order for the for the who qualifies through. So um, yeah, it's uh, it's a pretty common common tactic. To be honest, you always want to work together where you can, because um, obviously if we're both fighting for ages, then uh, we're not going to be going as fast as we can, and we're just going to leave ourselves open to losing out to people behind who will then just work together and not let us pass. So um, yeah, we start. We start in the right positions, the, the qualifying positions, and um, yeah, here we go then to the grid, see how the cart feels, we're, we're uh, trying to leave our frustrations of the heats behind, pretty frustrated to, to be in the C final, but it happens sometimes, so um, yeah, got to try and leave those behind to take our place in P2, first time we started on the even side of the grid all day, um, again, that seems to have happened a couple of rounds in a row now. Keep an eye over the shoulder just to see when all the carts are finally lined up. And uh, yeah, it looks like they're getting into place. So now we will look forward and uh, get ready for the lights. Here we go, waiting, waiting. There we go, the marshals up front showing us. Thumbs up, green light, away we go. How's the start? It's all right, it's all right, it's all right. But we don't want to get pushed outside. So we're going to cut back across on the inside. We're going to get a nudge in the rear rear corner but we it's important we get in that train behind the leader otherwise we just get washed out wide human DRS straight away we want to stay right on Ali we want to get pulling away so he's driving well we're, we're keeping up with him so yeah let's just keep it clean keep it clean no stupid mistakes no drama and uh, see how we can go so yeah Ali's pulled a, a comfortable car and a half length on us but we're we're okay with that for now. We'll uh, we'll just keep focused, keep our head down, keep going, and a little look over the shoulder to come up the hill. We're all right. Not too bad line there. Maybe a little bit slidey, but we we maintain the gap ahead. And uh, coming round this corner down the hill wasn't getting that too bad all day. It's the one I struggle with most usually, but for some reason the hairpin was giving me trouble today. Uh, I'm not sure what I was doing there, but that's all right. That's all right. And uh, how's the drive up the hill in this final? We're just maintaining. Hard to see with my face in the steering wheel, but yeah, just maintaining. Lose that a little bit towards the top of the hill, but taking that top corner nice there. And we, uh, we actually closed down a little bit of gap. And yeah, so it's going all right. It's going all right. Going to plan. We're keeping it clean. We're driving our pace. We're not fighting with Ali. Obviously, he's, he's a, a car and a half to a car length ahead of us. So yeah, we're, we're feeling comfortable. We're feeling good. Checking over the shoulder on the straight just to make sure there's no one behind. Oh, someone's caught up to us, so we're going to defend. A little bit of loading as we go into the corner, but yeah, we got that covered off. And then coming down the hill, yeah, we're clean, we're, we're ahead. So somebody's managed to catch up to us, and look how much time we've lost to Ali because we were defending from that guy in third place. It's just unbelievable how much time you lose when you are taking that defensive line and, uh, and trying to, to cover people off. And so where's it gone? He's not there anymore. So we're semi-defensive that time, kind of racing line, but we can't see him on the camera. Look over the shoulder just to make sure he's not there. And then we go, oh, and he's just going to launch us into the wall, and that is just absolutely unacceptable. I am absolutely raging at this point. Completely unacceptable. That is just not racing. He was nowhere near alongside. He's just driven straight into the side of me, forced me into the barrier not even attempted to get out of it, it's just completely unacceptable. But that's what happens down in these lower finals. You're down with the guys that haven't raced at this track much or are there just for the day. They're not in the championship, they don't care. He was kart number 33, he's just there for the day. He hasn't attended before, I don't know how many times he's been to the track. Just, yeah, just not, not happy. 
was going all right and then it's just put me in the wall completely unfairly and uh, and I'm miles off the back the race is long over short of all the other cars breaking down that's my day done um, and it's a very disappointing end to what started out as a promising day and, and kind of went downhill um, slowly and then off a cliff edge at the end so yeah that's um, I'm not even going to commentate over the rest because I'm just driving around don't make any mistakes not racing with anybody just driving angry basically um, but yeah just absolutely put in the wall and it is it is a fairly common problem um, every round at least one person gets put in the wall I guess today it was just my turn um, but yeah as I said earlier I've just got to be be better in the heats I've got to get out of these lower end of the field battles I've got to get away from the 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 guys that are just going to put you in the wall and not care because when you're in the in the front two of the heat and then the the A finals and the front half of the B final, the racing is clean. You know the guys gonna give you space when you do it. You know they're gonna uh, and yeah, see see me shake my head, say to Ali, I just got wiped out. Yeah, a bit simply from him. <laughs> but um, yeah, luckily the guy put in the wall did not qualify. He got overtaken by one of the other guys, Luke. Um, hi Luke, he uh, he's always uh, always following the page and everything. So really appreciate that. Nice to actually speak to you for the first time properly on uh, at this event. But um, yeah just oh i just had to hang back a moment here and just let everybody get out of the way i needed to clear my mind um but yeah that's gonna do it for round six guys a disappointing end but um round seven coming up soon so um yeah look out for that one and thank you very much again for watching i'll get some uh, indoor footage up soon and um yeah thank you very much again guys enjoy the rest of your day and uh, remember to hit the like and subscribe button all that good stuff check out my social media facebook instagram and uh, see you in the next one thank you very much